my name is Andy Hayes, and I'm the uh, department head at the Vacuum Microwave Device Department. The Vacuum Microwave Device Department is the department within the RF Accelerator Engineering Division that makes the devices that both power the accelerator and also makes the devices under test. Accelerator structures, high power microwave components, so that ranges from klystrons to waveguide components, and we also support many other experimental components. We used to be called the klystron department, and the initial mission was to actually build, test, and get installed the klystrons that power the SLAC LINAC. You know, there's roughly 240 of those up and down the LINAC used to accelerate the electron beam using the experiments at SLAC, you know, from the beginning. When the SLAC LINAC was designed, it required RF sources that didn't exist yet. So these klystrons are now being used at many labs uh, in the U.S. and around the world, including CERN, uh, Paul Scheer Institute, and Synchrotron Trieste in Italy. The vacuum bake furnaces that you see behind me are, are special double vacuum furnaces for baking uh, finished devices, where the exterior active surfaces are only exposed to a very clean vacuum system. And we can, we can bake things out here at approximately 600 degrees, uh, you know, plus or minus a bit C. And we'll leave them on the bake stations even uh, two, three weeks or more to really get the ultimate low pressure for uh, long life and good performance. Since these devices are, are pushing the state of the art of this type of technology, we really have to be on top of the material quality the handling, the processing, the attention to detail through the whole process. We have people that have been working here for 25, 30 years, even more. We have other fairly new, new staff as well, so we have a certain amount of continuity, both in the manufacturing side and in the engineering uh, simulation side. Our focus is to deliver the devices that physicists need to do their work. That's really priority one.